Good idea. Call her for me. Ask if she's free some night. Thing is, you'd have to surrender control again. Yeah. I'll call her. Okay. Let's Delta. Nothing to see here after all. Worth coming out all the same. Absolutely. Thanks, V. Of all the heads I could have popped up in, hella glad it was yours. Johnny wants to ask you out on a date. What do you think? Johnny's asking? Or is it you? Johnny? You're the one who said you got no trouble telling us apart. Okay. And where'd we go? Where'd you want to go? Silver Pixel Cloud in North Oak. Okay. I'll swing by the afterlife. Pick you up. Some crew taking you along as bait? That a compliment? You look... different. <laughs> Try hey, again. Rogue. Ready? Maybe you'll find some again. charm third time you. around. We going? Where's Joni? Couldn't make it after all? I'm just your driver. See you keep him on a short leash. <laughs> Wise beyond your years. This... Johnny's Porsche? <laughs> Where'd you get it? That's what was in the container. The one Grayson was talking about. Hmm. Okay. <laughs> Got a lot of memories in this car. Let's go. Silver Pixel Cloud, your favorite place? Once, probably. Haven't been there in ages. Drive-ins went out of style a century ago. But Silver Pixel's still hanging in there. Sounds like a preem place for a date. Thought so too. Which is why I suggested Johnny take me there. A million years ago. So it wasn't his idea. Of course not. His idea of a romantic night out was blowing up Arasaka HQ. Alright, V. Tell me what's going on. For real. Meaning... Johnny doesn't do a thing without an ulterior motive. So what's in play this time? Johnny's changed. He really does want to spend some time with you. No hooks, no lines, no sinkers. Right. Rogue? Just taking it all in. <laughs> a selfless Johnny Silverhand. Apparently you're a positive influence on him.
Here we are. Fuck. I don't believe it. It really has been years. Managed to shut the whole thing down. V, try to get inside. Can't stop us, won't stop us. We asked you out on a date. All right. Do your thing. I'll watch. Okay. Gotta be the past, this. Guess we really are going to the movies. Shalala. Well done. Try and get the projector started. I'll get us some seats. Sure thing. Exactly where I was supposed to take her 50 odd years ago. Right, let's go check the projector. Entrance is over here. No. Oh, interesting. Bushido 10. Fade to black. Must be a classic by now. Okay, looks like I found the projector. You wouldn't happen to know how to get it up and running. About to see. Look at that. Last played Bushido 10. Perfect. Looks like a spurt of runny shit. V, we're at a drive-in. Movie's the last thing we care about. Just want some background noise, a little blood, tits, and gore, that sort of thing. Bushido will give you that. Thanks, V. Don't mention it. Just this time, don't go roaming around town. And no tattoos, and don't clean out my cred. All right, V. Run along. I'll take it from here. Have fun, you crazy kids. Grabbed us the best spots. Hop on up. This is how you imagine this evening going? Always knew things would have to change for us to just go out and catch a movie. Never imagined they'd change this much. Let's pretend it's 2015, huh? We just met, and I got no idea what a bastard you are. Sure, lured you to the movies so we could bang, by the way. <laughs> it's technically a possibility, you know? Okay, so it's 2015. If you could do it all again, what would you change? Anything at all? I'd do everything in my power not to lose you. Johnny, I... Hey, hey, hey. What's this? Nothing, it's just... Had a lot of time to think while you were away. What ifs and all that. Think you might be hiding something from me. Johnny, there's a heap of things I'm hiding from you. But all we got's this one night. It's more than I ever could have asked for. Rogue, I'm here on borrowed time in a borrowed body. But I'm here.
Johnny, I can't. It's not right. <sighs> Mina, not fair to V? Not fair to you. Tried so hard to pretend nothing's changed. To pretend I'm the same rogue you knew. Actually managed to fool myself for a little. <sighs> Get back on my own. Rogue! Fuck. Rogue's gone. Yep. You fought. What about? Uh, got no idea. Was gonna be a nice night at the drive-in. Now she's mad and won't tell me what about. Maybe it's just you. Maybe she just lost interest. Uh, no, it's definitely not me. Remember Grayson? How they spoke? How weird it was? Weird's not the word, I don't think. He was toying with her. Could be something to that. Gotta mull it over. For now, take me to North Oak. That's supposed to help you figure out Rogue? No, Carrie. Tell you once we're there. Movie was a turd wrapped in crepe paper. You Farida? Yes, and we're closed. Got something might interest you? I doubt it. Here you collect trinkets. Unification war era. Mm-hmm. Come in. I'm sorry I was unwelcoming. Ever since a certain space plane crashed nearby, I've had to be more cautious. V, good to see you. Good you're here, Reed. Need to talk, we do. My sentiments exactly. I'm here about Somi. I spent hours wrapping my head around this, putting myself in her shoes. I needed to understand what she must have been going through, too. To resort to treason. You're in no position to understand, Reed. Your life ain't on a timer. But I know death. Stared him in the eyes up close. She's trapped. Not just here and now, but going months back. Hell. Actually years. I blame Myers, a sore loser. Does her damnedest to avoid it. Songbird, the black wall, dirty tricks meant to give her a competitive edge. It's no wonder Somi doesn't trust anyone, except maybe you, a little. There's a prison cell prepped and waiting for her already. Somi knows that full well. She lives to see tomorrow and every day after. That's what matters. Myers needs her alive, sure, but forgive and forget the attempt on her life. Never. 
Myers might not forgive her, but doesn't mean I can. You forgetting? Woman tried to zero you, too. Her hand's been forced too many times in her life. She's due compensation. Okay. We break the chain Hanson wrapped around her neck. Then what? We stow away somewhere safe, ask some questions, establish some common ground. Once I get the answers I'm looking for, I'll personally help her disappear from everyone, everywhere, including Myers. Say I believe you. Where's your plan go from there? I got contacts in Europe. We'll find the best clinic, put you two back together, fix what's broken. Once we have your cure in hand. But I need to help Somi first. She's lost, and I'm concerned she doesn't know what she's doing. You don't trust her? What I don't trust is the shit from beyond the black wall and the attendant paranoia. Both in play here, I'm afraid. She has another plan in mind. I'm damn sure of it. Sumi... She reached out. Wasn't telling the whole truth before. Months out. Off the grid. Has it planned for right after we take down Hanson. Gonna make a run for it. Slip out of Night City. I... Thank you, V, for your candor. This means a lot to me. I have something for you. Our best minds in D.C. cooked it up. Icebreaker. Silver bullet against any fortified netrunner. Farida will feed it into your system during surgery. Use that, and Somi will drop unconscious within a minute. We can't take any chances, and when she wakes up, she'll wake up at home. Okay. How do I use it? Fire it up when you're both jacked into the mainframe. At that moment, Somi's door will be wide open. <sighs> This'll turn to shit. Who says it has to? <laughs> Don't know, man. But say you do corner her. Expect the unexpected, if you know what I mean. There comes a time when all expectations are null and void. Right now, we're focusing on saving your lives. Talking time will come later. It's time I was on my way. I leave you in Farida's able hands. Call me once you're done here. The sooner we begin, the sooner we finish. Okay, no time to lose. Tush, meet chair. Okay, anesthesia incoming. Don't worry, it's the good stuff. Relax and submit. An ID modding implant is complicated tech, true. But the procedure is surprisingly simple. So, you a Night City native? Yet more questions. Did they tell you nothing about not delving? But, yes. I'm from Watson. Oh, you gotta know Victor then. He's a chum. You would truly be better off keeping things like that to yourself. Okay. Anesthesia is taking hold.
Stop fidgeting. How many Don't fingers am I holding up? Now, <laughs> now, Johnny. Fuck off, please. You missed me. Warms the cockles. Truly. So tell me, what's it feel like to be a traitor? Come on. You know this is a lose-lose clusterfuck of a sitch. I ain't here by choice. At least you see that. Means they haven't turned you yet. Not completely. Come on, got iron in your hand. Gotta put it to someone's head. Pull the trigger. The master spy and the agent unloosed. Tragedy, comedy, or both. Reed, I understand. But I don't get what you have against her. Let's just say I know where they're both coming from. Survival. It's her be-all and end-all. That and she's a walking, talking nuke. The kind that keeps making mistakes, never knowing which one's gonna set her off. And Reed? Bastard and me are one and the same. If I hadn't ghosted the army, I'd have become a Reed myself. Live and die by our principles. That's the tragedy, V. Someone's gonna play victim to the other's good intentions. Try not to forget that when you're standing over that fucking overgrown neuro drive. <sighs> Some help you've been. Just don't do anything either of us will regret later. Not you, not me. And don't kid yourself. Both of them need you, but neither trusts you. Well done. The facial morph implant is online. Now all you need is a behavioral imprint. And do me a favor. Don't tell me what you need this for. Might pop by if I need anything else. I can't wait. Hey, procedure's a wrap. V, I hope you're not feeling too raw post for Rita's work. It's time to intercept and supplant the Netrunners. Just one hiccup. Our access to Karen Exotics was cut. They must have discovered us. Wait, seriously? So we lost them? Not entirely. We know they were last in oh, city center. It's Head here. Out direction. Yes? Find a vantage point near the entrance of Dogtown. You'll grab a trace on the runners as they drive to the meeting. Hey, open for biz today? Today, yes. And if you blab on, I may forget the anesthetic. Hey, Jude, what's up? Uh, you know, same old. You? Finish this another time. Right, so then what? <laughs> Funny, I was just thinking about you. So, do I got amazing timing, or are you always thinking about me? You know, I could be cursing your name in my thoughts. 
Oh, hey. I'm just glad you remember me at all. Cause I got a favor to ask. Ask away. It's never boring with you. Interesting people aren't easily bored. Not in your company. Okay, now that we've blown each other, what's up? You're on a need-to-know basis. So, this particular mission don't require you to have no gun. Just a wetsuit. All right, then count me in. But I gotta warn you, I look great in a wetsuit. Believe it when I see it. <laughs> Damn outpast Rancho Coronado. Know it? Sure. What about it? Little, uh, abandoned bungalow lakeside. Meet me there. At sundown. Sounds like a plan. See you there. Bye bye All good, all good. Let's go, go, go. Check the courts. Watch out, B. Think we pissed someone off. Oh, can't be cheap, boop, yes, boop. They 